pregnant mom's belly covered in bruises, but an ultrasound explained everything. Most quints are delivered at the 28-week mark. The last couple of decades have seen a rise in multiple births. Fertility treatments have contributed to this surge. As adorable as it may appear to have two or more babies at the same time, it is a risk both for the mother as well as the fetuses. For the babies there is a risk of preterm labor, low birth weight, and miscarriage. For the mom-to-be, she can develop diabetes, preeclampsia, and placenta eruption. Still, moms are happy to follow their doctor's instructions to ensure they are delivering healthy babies. Guillermina and Fernando Garcia welcomed quintuplets at the University of Utah Hospital in Salt Lake City. Garcia delivered her quints at 31 and half weeks of gestation. Less than 10 sets of quintuplets are born in the United States each year. 34 year old Guillermina sought fertility drugs to get pregnant. During the pregnancy, the mom had bruising all over her belly. I was excited to see them and see that they were okay, that everything turned out normally, Guillermina said. Doctors were so impressed with Guillermina. She developed high blood pressure and other medical concerns but the medical staff said she never complained. They have a one-year-old daughter already named Yulita. The University of Utah Hospital had delivered plenty of twins, triplets, and quadruplets but never quintuplets before. The medical team said they used their experience of multiple births and applied it to the quintuplets. It took a medical staff of 40, led by eight doctors to bring the quints into the world. Each baby weighed between two to three pounds. Three girls and two boys were delivered, Esmeralda, Fatima, Marissa, Fernando, and Jordan. The couple is originally from Guanajuato, Mexico, said family members who live close by will help. We feel like we're dreaming, proud dad Fernando Garcia said. It's incredible that we have five. Guillermina spent the last two months of her pregnancy on bed rest. The babies were born within two minutes of each other. The biggest baby was Jordan weighing 3 pounds and 14 ounces. Doctors are positive the babies will grow up strong and healthy. The girls were breathing on their own, while the two boys needed breathing tubes. Fernando, who works as a welder, was told by his boss he can take as much time off as he needs. When asked how they plan to take care of their quints, Guillermina said, I don't know. Her husband feels more confident about it. Now that they're here, we'll find a way. We're through the hardest part. The babies were expected to stay in the hospital another six weeks. None of the babies are identical, hence, they are each from a separate, fertilized egg.